Hey gorgeous! I am bringing you a relaxed video today. Uh, yeah, I wanted to do something different. And <laughs> it's inspired by my real life, as with everything on this channel. And if this silly little hair will just stay... <laughs> Stay. Many of you know that I'm a mom of three. My oldest son just turned six in December. And so it's been six years since I've really picked up one of my purses because my life is all about the diaper bag. <laughs> Which don't get me wrong, I love it because it's big and it holds everything. But I miss my purses from time to time. And when my husband and I went out on a date not too long ago, this was like two weeks ago, I just happened to pull one of my purses out of the closet and I was going through it to put my wallet and my phone in it and I was <laughs> shocked at some of the things I was pulling out of this purse and so I thought this might be a cute idea for a video to um, pick up my purses that have been sitting on my shelves for six years now and it's kind of like a um, purse time capsule. You know, who doesn't love time capsules? So let's see what's in them. I used to love purses before I had kids. Oh my gosh, I got rid of a lot of them, but I have four that remain that were my absolute favorites. So I'll just show you the purses, cause you know, ugh, love them. This one is from Kate Spade. It was one, oh, yeah, I used it all the time. And this is one from Coach, which has a shoulder strap inside, but really is very versatile. This was one my husband bought for my birthday many years ago and I have the matching shoes to it, if you can believe it. Oh yeah, they're fabulous too. I'll see if I can find them and show them to you before the end of the video. <laughs> and then this was another one of my favorites from Coach. Love it, love the brightness of it. This purse is the one that I took on our date recently. And this was, some of these things, I already know what's in here, but I was a little surprised to find some of the things that I did find in here. So one of my discoveries was the Essence Lip Liner in the shade Satin Mauve, which was a favorite of mine for a while, way back in the day. I don't even know if you can get it anymore, probably not, but it was the perfect nude. It went with so many lipsticks, which is why it was in my purse. And then this little, okay. <laughs> Pepper gel. <laughs> Pepper gel. Don't mess with Z, let me tell you. With UV dye. Okay, so if the pepper spray wasn't enough, or I should say the pepper gel wasn't enough, you're gonna be glowing. <laughs> yes. I think my dad got this for me actually because he was concerned at the time. This was years ago. I mean, this thing probably doesn't even work. I need to test it out. But this was years ago when he was concerned um, I was going to a college campus at the time and there was a lot of things that were happening and he was like, please protect yourself, carry this. I was like, okay, dad. But I, I'll be honest with you, I was so scared of it <laughs> for a while. I think I sprayed it outside once just to test it. And then, I, oh yeah, I always have my husband's glasses in my purses. So yeah, that was kind of funny. Pen, gotta have a pen. These little Sharpie pens are my favorite. Favorite, I love these. The shoulder strap for the purse is in the purse. That's <laughs> where it should be. And then this, this little pocket brought me so much joy. You're not gonna believe what I found in here. So I found an old hair tie, cause yeah, I mean, come on. You gotta put it up sometimes. A chapstick, oh, what was this? Chap it, chap it, lip balm. My business cards, I, I don't think I ever, I never talked about these. I mean, why would I? But I used to hand these out to people when they would ask what I did for a living because it, you have no idea how weird it is when somebody asks you what you do for a living and then you say, uh, I make videos. <laughs> and they're like, what kind of videos? <laughs> like, no, 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 it's makeup and beauty, okay? It's on YouTube. <laughs> but then it begins this whole line of new questions of well, how do you make money on YouTube? How do you get paid? How does that work? And I can't tell you, I mean, for a while, I didn't tell people what I did for a living. I would just say I was in marketing just because I wanted to avoid the questions. I mean, I really did. But then my dad, uh, this was also years ago, probably along with the pepper spray, honestly, he told me to start handing out business cards when people would ask me. And he's like, give me business cards and I'll hand them out to people. And my dad was just so awesome. He would go around handing these business cards out to everyone. Go watch my daughter on YouTube. My daughter's on YouTube, like all the time. It was so funny. He was so proud. It's just, I love that these brought back that memory. And so it was just a picture of myself on the front with 
my channel, like you can see there. Isn't that neat? Just memory lane. So yeah, I didn't hand them out that much. I really made them for my dad because <laughs> proud papa. I think that was everything in this purse. I got one more pocket. Oh, no, it wasn't. Okay. Yeah, oh yeah, this notepad I had for years. You never find Z's anywhere, ever. Monogram Z's, anything. So when I do find them, I always buy them. And this was the cutest little notepad. Had a magnetic top there. And then it has a little Z on top. And I would make my shopping lists and notes and things like that on this. Another pen, can't be without those. Nail file, because yes, my nails break. Oh, and then my nail clipper. This came in handy recently because I had a hangnail when I was on my date with my husband and I was like, oh no. And I said, please let there be a hang uh, clipper in my purse. Sure enough, there was. Thank you to my former self <laughs> for thinking of me in the future. And then this, oh, this is another one down memory lane. Old lip liner. Now, if you've been on my channel for a long time, you remember this one. This is Max Staunchly Stylish. Look at <laughs> I loved this one too. And it's just a dupe really for Oh my gosh, is it working even? Let me see. Oh no, it's not even working anymore. It's completely dried out. Oh, it's, yeah, it's, boy, that's gone. Okay, but it's the same color as that right there. And I loved this one. You like my bruise? I'm such a klutz, man. I, I was just walking through the house the other day and I literally went, bam, knocked my hand right into the bar stool. I'm like, really? Like, you couldn't avoid that? Okay, well, I have to throw this out. That was that purse. And let's move on to the pink purse. Now, I let someone borrow this hmm, probably like a year ago, so I don't know if there's much in here because I did clean it out before I gave it to them. Oh, wow, okay, yeah, so it, what I think I did was when I got the purse back, I went and put all the stuff that was in it back in it. <laughs> An old eyelash adhesive. I carried eyelash adhesive like it was my, yeah, like I had to have it. It was like water to me. Oil absorbing sheets from Walgreens. Oh yeah, buddy. <laughs> it's empty. Is there one left? Three. Okay, there's three left. Floss, cause you gotta have it. I mean, that's where I would put my floss. All You know when you go to the dentist and they give you those little baggies that you take home? That was where the floss always ended up. It was always in my purse because I always had a use for it. Oh yeah, all the time. I'm surprised I haven't found more of these in my purses. A pen, another pen, leopard, gotta love it. And another nail file, <laughs> gotta have them. And a choker, a choker, okay. This, I remember this was one, oh man, I used this in a video actually. I think it was the 90s video that I did years ago. I don't know why it's in the purse, but I have to hang that back up. Next, okay, Kate Spade purse. Um, let's see here. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. Okay, I know exactly what this is. My Chanel Boy lipstick. Been looking for this one. Ah, found it. And this is, oh, it's a pretty nude. I don't buy Chanel anymore because, yeah, kids. But <laughs> isn't that beautiful? I love it. Oh, I'm so glad I found it and it's still fresh hallelujah uh, and then this one nars cruella velvet matte lip pencil i don't know why okay oh that's a red look at that hello wow yeah i must have been going through a red phase when i was using this purse <laughs> another lash adhesive from kiss and i think was that oh and a setting spray okay Mac Fix Plus, the watermelon one. Let's see. Let me get it to spray. Oh, okay. Oh, that's nice. Let's see if it, there's anything else in here. Nope, nope. Okay, this purse was pretty clean. Not much else there. Okay, I'm not really sure. Oh, you know what? Hmm. These little guys, I just came across those. I believe those actually go to the strap on my camera that I am filming with. <laughs> so those are good to find. All right, and then the last purse, the gold one that goes with everything. This one has got pockets galore. What I liked about this one was that you could put stuff in here 
like right there. Isn't that neat? And you have another pocket right here and then you got pockets inside. It's like pockets, 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 pockets. So there's nothing in that pocket. What about this one? Nothing in there. Okay, so nothing in the outside pockets. On the inside, I have the strap for the purse, pins. Oh, okay, pins. And then, what is that? Oh, eye, eyeglass holder, okay. Uh, that must have been for my husband's glasses whenever they went in the purse. <laughs> Another pocket here, no, nothing in there. Okay, well that purse was pretty clean too. So before I leave you, I promised you I would show you the shoes. Aren't those fabulous? Ah, oh. and you wouldn't think that they were comfortable, but they really are. Like they were super comfortable and they look great with black leggings. Oh my goodness, but yeah, fabulous. I feel like I'm getting to a place with the kids where it's, it's getting easier. I mean, Ace is three and he's the only one that's left in diapers because the older two are potty trained. And even we're still working, we're working with him right now on potty training, but he's not quite there yet. And I'm a big believer, having gone through it with my oldest son and my daughter, don't push them until they're ready. Don't, or they will regress. I have gone through it. It is a nightmare. So I never, ever, 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 ever judge anyone for taking their time with potty training their child. You have to wait until they're ready. So yeah, that's where we're at with Ace right now. And he just turned three, you know, and he's just now learning to pull his pants up and down. So anyway, but that's really, I mean, honestly, I think even though he's in diapers, even when he's out of diapers, I really find myself still using a bigger bag. I mean, bags like this were nice before I had kids and everything, and they were good for carrying around the things that I needed, you know, and whatnot, but it's like your priorities change, you know, and now I carry snacks and water and uh, pants and shirts and underwear, you know, God forbid. <laughs> Not for me, but for them. So, I mean, it's like, yeah, you have to really just go with the flow, and I'm really happy with where I'm at and I look back on purses like these and it takes me back to a, a really fun time in my life, you know, a time when I could get up and go and do whatever I wanted. But yeah, I'm really, really happy with where I'm at now and I wouldn't trade the experiences I've had for anything, you know, so yeah. But this was fun and I enjoyed making this kind of video. I wanted to do something a little different, a little departure from what I normally do. I'll try to start thinking of videos like this that are more outside the box because I mean, yeah, makeup is fun and all that, but I have other interests too. I mean, there's other things that I like. So if you want to see other content like this, let me know your thoughts too. And I hope that you enjoyed this for a change today. I speak love, peace, and joy into you and into your home. And I look forward to seeing you again next time.